Hello everybody, so today is the week three of the Monstera cuttings and as you can see that there are quite a lot of dead leaves and I'm going to cut them off today just to kind of make the plants or the cuttings look a lot nicer because having the dead leaves is kind of spoiling the vibe that I'm going for. So again we'll show you the roots that are coming along incredibly nicely um, such as from this cutting they're doing very well and as you can see from here they're growing quite nicely they're getting a little bit more complex now as well and soon they'll be ready for planting i mean to be fair you probably could plant them at this stage but i'm not going to i like to watch them grow a little bit more before i do that but that's i think just kind of like personal preference So this one is a little bit slower, it's only got the one leaf and it's got only sort of like one kind of root that's sort of growing. It's got a little bit of a point there but it's not it's not as fast as some of the others. But that's okay, it's still doing very well so hopefully we'll, it will catch up and it will be able to be planted with the other ones soon. So this is the one with our new leaf. You can see it's beginning to uncurl, which is quite exciting. I always like to see the new leaves come in. And the root system of this is doing quite well as well. It's growing bent like that, just because it's at the bottom of the glass, that's all. And it's got a few more different points on it as well. Similarly, the ones in the vase are also doing very well. Um, hopefully I won't have to take these out because I don't want to disturb them too much but you can see the roots are really starting to come in now you can also see here potentially that floating kind of mist that seems to be some kind of fungus and there is some other points in there as well so I'm going to very carefully clean these roots and remove this fungus because I don't want anything to kind of infect the plant and any infections are best avoided of course so I'm just going to clean them with some water, some running water and my fingers and it should be pretty straightforward and hopefully we'll avoid any complications with the cuttings. This is the other vase, this one was the slower of the two but it is also catching up as you can see it's got newly, um, new roots growing here. And there are some on the edge of this cutting just there, that little white dot just here. And that seems to be kind of all of the more developed roots. But there are a couple of points, there's one here, and there's a couple down there too. Now onto our pot. And this is getting very interesting as there are a number of points where it is growing new shoots. That's always very interesting to watch, especially in a cutting like this, when you're not entirely sure how it's going to do. So points of new growth are... there's one. There's a second one here. Is there? And the most interesting part of all of this, in my opinion, is the shoots that we've been watching for the last two weeks. And it's actually getting a leaf that is growing out of it. So that is our little friend here. So hopefully I'll be able to show you a lot more clearly. Just there. So this is the shoot that we have been watching and it's growing very, very interestingly in my opinion. So what you see there is probably like a bent bend of the new stem that will come out. But of course we'll keep an eye on it and I'll update you next week and we'll see what it's doing. But it is very pretty and I always enjoy watching new shoots when they start to do this because I just like to see what comes out of it at the end. Conquer trees also do this quite a lot in the spring as well and they're also incredibly fun to watch. So that point there is another little shoot that has come out so again we'll be keeping an eye on these ones and we'll see how they do over the next couple of weeks. Hopefully as the plant continues to thrive with the lack of competition, we'll get more and more shoots and they'll turn into stems which turn into new leaves and new growth. So yeah, 
that's week three. They are doing very, very well and we will have a new bush very soon. <laughs>